The Holly 1920 is absolutely, without a doubt, the worst carburetor ever made. And that's why it's on the floor. Today on Dead Dodge Garage, we're gonna make this 1970 Dart um, not bad anymore. And the way we're gonna do that <sighs> is the Holly 1920 delete. What? That could have been worse. However, it does not idle. Except when it does, but it's a trick. This particular 1920 was remanufactured in 2017, five years ago, and it's still junk. I actually went through it recently and cleaned it out and it got better for about five minutes and then it stopped idling again. I'm not about messing with that anymore. So how are we gonna solve this problem? With the Carter BBS, of course. Normally I would throw this thing, but well, we might still need it. And it's just that easy, uh, except that now we need a different fuel line. All of the controls and lines hook up exactly the same, other than this, of course. You gotta go dig in your collection of one barrel cores and find that little fella, or make one, or buy a nipple. Well, that's weird, it idles now. Might be too nice. Unlimited power? Ah, uh, well, it is still a slant six. With tiny drum brakes. They kind of do something. Drives awesome. This thing's been down for like six months. Maybe more? Let's just say the owner is going to be very happy to get it back. Are you or a loved one suffering from profound Slant 6 disappointment due to Holly 1920 syndrome? Call www.ebaymotors.com forward slash Carter BBS today. There's a weird dry noise in the rear end. I'm choosing not to worry about that for now. You know, I love these 70 darts. Okay, sure, I'd prefer a swinger, but it's still pretty good. Yeah, how about that? It's perfect, right out of the box. Good to go. Now, instead of telling her it's fixed, I'm just gonna park it right in her way, and uh, I'm sure she'll notice eventually. Yes, one, please, one please do a burnout. Uh, I don't know if I can. <laughs> Yay, we did it. Oh yeah, performance machine. I didn't do that. Hey, thanks for watching. And remember, in the Game of Thrones, you either win or you die. Now that looks familiar.